put in place in the first half? Uh, just being aggressive, uh, taking advantage of you know mismatches and just playing some basketball, having some fun. Yeah, I wasn't in during that stretch, but uh, yeah, that's just a part of uh, understanding and having experience and playing with poise. Teams are going to make runs. How can we get back um, on track and stuff like that? And that's like awareness from us, but also awareness from the coaching staff. Um, so, you know, in the playoffs and times where it gets like that, you know, timeout would be great, but we also got to be great at being able to get ourselves settled back down. For sure, I think that we're a more organized team this year. Um, we have, you know, actions. You just, we are, you know, we think in the game. We're trying to be the smarter team every night. And we take our time. We identify, you know, uh, mismatches, and we we play the game the right way. I think this is one of the best years that we've done that since I've been a Celtic. Uh, has it surprised me? No. Um, we, we'll, we've been preparing for the moments that matter most. So um, that's all we, we focus on. We're just taking it one day at a time. Um, we're trying to come out each and every night, be the best version of ourselves. We got a talented team, you know, guys in, guys out. We come out and find ways to win. Um, but we also build in with a mindset towards the postseason. Reading the game, you know, realizing fast, but like playing slow, recognizing what they're in, how they're guarding you, where the advantages are on the floor, and then taking your time. So, you know, not getting too sped up, not allowing teams to try to muck up the game. We're the more talented team. Uh, we got to be the smarter team as well. And when we do that, we're going to be tough to beat. Yeah, I think we could even be even better on defense. I think we gave up a lot of points tonight, even though, like, uh, I think, what did they have, 100? Did they have less than 100 tonight? Yeah, we still could have. I think they should have had around 88. And that was just uh, some some mistakes that we made that, you know, in the playoffs and stuff like that, we don't want to make teams get on runs and we can guard a lot better than we did tonight. No, when it comes down to the playoffs, none of that stuff really matters. You know, I feel like, you know, it's going to be about matchups. It's going to be about playing hard. Obviously, home court matters, so that, that is key. But, you know, when you get into the thick of it, you got to win basketball games, regardless of what your seat is. If anything, it puts more pressure on you. Um, but I think we're experienced team. We've been in these situations before, and I think we're ready. I think we've been doing the, I think we've been great at it all year. I think we've been identifying mismatches, playing the game through each other. You know, we've everybody has, you know, sacrificed a little bit. Um, and we all just, you know, kind of play the game the way it's supposed to be played. I think we've been pretty consistent in that all year long, you know, and I think that's going to be key, especially in those moments of adversity when it gets tough. It, how, how much can we stick to that game plan? But I think we've done a good job all year long of just trusting each other and playing basketball. Yes, I think it's made me a more um, efficient basketball player um, just because, you know, make the game easier for yourself. You know, I feel like I can score with the best of them on anybody. But uh, when you are identifying and manipulating the game and getting the right match matchups on you, playing slow, taking your time, you know, those are easier baskets and then they start doubling. Um, you want to double, okay, I'm going to drag the double out, make the right plays, and our team is going to get open looks. So just, you know, Making the game, thinking the game, manipulating the game is all about uh, what we've been, you know, emphasizing this year. Last question. You were 
rising to star in this league, like you were doing a lot of just showing a significant amount of skill to pull off other hard plays. How much of like being a great player is accepting you don't have to do the amazing thing rather than that you gotta do the easy thing? Yeah, that's the key. I just I think this year has been more um, simplifying everything for me, just you know, getting to my spots. Um, and just playing the game, you know, making easy, smart basketball plays. Because it's going to come a time where the difficulty level is going to get raised, and then uh, I'm going to have to have to meet the call. But for now, like for the most part, you know, for our team, I think just benefiting off of making just the, the easy, simple play, it, nothing's wrong with that. Presented by your New England Ford dealers. Built for America. Built Ford Proud.